San Antonio, Texas is known for landmarks such as the Riverwalk and the Alamo, but also for hot and humid weather. So maybe it's fitting that one of the more revolutionary inventions when it comes to cooling systems comes from a company called Vortex Technologies, a few miles outside of San Antonio. Uh, Vortex Technologies is a company that offers non-chemical water treatment systems for industrial use, for evaporative condensers and for cooling towers. Uh, we treat the water within those towers non-chemically uh, so that that water can be reused and so that the customer does not have to worry about uh, bothering with chemicals. Vortex's solution uses a method called hydrodynamic cavitation. This means that cooling water is forced through two nozzles creating a vortex stream where bubbles form and collapse. The bubbles collapse through a violent process where the temperature of the vapor within the bubble may be several thousand degrees Fahrenheit and the pressure several hundred atmospheres, releasing enough energy to destroy bacteria. The largest advantages of vortex is unlike chemical treatment. With chemical treatment someone has to be there and monitoring the system you know, on a weekly basis. Uh, because you know, if, you, if you change the chemistry too much in one direction, the system becomes corrosive. If you change the chemistry another way, it scales up. Um, so there's a very fine line that you have to monitor and keep things so that they're not corrosive or scaling. Uh, the Vortex system, um, being it non-chemical, is also a very stable system. Uh, if, if the operating parameters are appropriate, you don't have scale, you don't have corrosion, you don't have to have someone there every week making sure everything's fine. Vortex skids are exported to cooling systems all over the world. But as more and more systems are being deployed, it becomes increasingly important to keep track of all these systems and their operation without actually going on site. We normally have to go out once a month and check the equipment, make sure it's operating correctly, make sure the customers are doing their job. Uh, some customers are very good at doing their job, while other ones not so much. Um, so what we ended up looking at is we wanted to find a way to gather information and know how the equipment is doing out in the field without having one of our people, you know, uh, standing in front of the equipment. To solve the issue of remote management, Vortex found the NetBiter solution from HMS Industrial Networks. NetBiter is a complete remote management solution meaning that it includes everything from the gateway which connects to Vortex's PLC in the field via a cloud-based data hosting center to the user interface accessible via a regular web page. So we have a PLC that is monitoring all of the, the operation of the system, deciding when it's time to take a next backwash, how it does a backwash, how to control a different filter for operation, how to control the conductivity in the system and decide what it needs to do next. So in this system, the NetBiter is interfaced directly into our PLC, and it's a PLC that's interfaced into all of the sensors, into the motor controls, uh, into the power supplies and everything else. The gateway in the field sends information via the cellular network to a cloud-based server called NetBiter Argos. Vortex and their customers log into NetBiter Argos at netbiter.net where it's possible to see all parameters such as backwash counts, conductivity, filter status and other parameters which are crucial for the maintenance of the treatment skids. One example of a Vortex treatment system can be found in the San Marcos Conference Center outside San Antonio. A building of this size requires a lot of cooling water which all passes through this cooling tower on the building roof. With the help of Vortex's system, this water is purified without the use of chemicals, prolonging equipment life and saving the environment. A NetBiter gateway is installed into the cabinet, sending information from the skid as of day one of operation. What we've decided to do is we actually bring all NetBiters up online here in the building. Um, it allows us to build the customer interface, it allows us to, to select the NetBiter that we're going to be choosing for a specific customer. Uh, set everything up, test it, and then all we do is send it out into the field. It simply plugs into the, the side of our PLC, connects into our power, and our technician at that point turns the system on and verifies that, that he is live on NetBiter on the wireless web. After using the NetBiter remote management solution for a couple of years, Carl Stefan at Vortex has seen how useful it can be to provide customers with better information about their systems. As an experienced NetBiter user, 
Carl Stefan also has a couple of tips to new users of NetBiter. When we when we first started looking at at, at NetBiter, uh, I had downloaded the manuals. Um, but one trap that I fell into that I would suggest that, that people would definitely keep up with is keep up with all the new manuals um, because I had the, the NetBatter group came to visit me a few months back and they started talking about some of the options on the, on the Argo system that I was unaware of. Um, and we soon realized that they were in the updated manuals but not in the manual I was using as a reference. And so a lot of the questions that I had, if I would have only kept up with the most recent advances in the manual, would have been answered for me. Uh, so that's, that's probably number one. Uh, number two is don't be afraid of NetBiter. Um, when we started this process, we envisioned uh, you know, a, a specific type of interface and specific type of functions. But as we started to play, as we started to realize what its capabilities really were, our expectations changed. And so we were very willing to grow with those, those expect expectation changes and change what that user interface looked like because once we started getting feedback from customers, we realized that was actually where the, where the power lied. Not necessarily in its original offering, but its flexibility. With a customer or with another, another person asking me about NetBiter, again, the best thing that I could possibly give you is it's very flexible. It's a complete package. I don't have to. I don't have to go out to different um, cell phone vendors and get the cards. I can buy the cards directly from from NetBiter for use all over the world. It was the, the appropriate choice for me because it, it allowed me to grow things as my expectations changed. Uh, it allowed me to see what was really going on and, and come up with an offering that you know not only Vortex is proud of, but our customers are happy to have.